That's why, that's why scientists say Eureka all the time, when they actually figure it out, because they fail so much. Are you going to find the cure for cancer? Yes, next week. <laughs> Honestly, I've, I've always wanted to be a scientist. But I remember taking a class early on in uh, elementary school, just something very basic, uh, back in Mexico in this, in this really small lab. I just, I just knew that's what I wanted to do. And fortunately, I was right. I, I really enjoy science. <laughs> The focus of my research has been to really uh, try to identify some new targets, some new places where, where uh, you know, a drug or some sort of treatment can like just get in there, stop the process, and prevent cells from dividing. What you're doing is you're trying to push the boundaries of knowledge. You know, you're trying to go into somewhere in a direction that no one has ever gone. So you will fail, but you will learn in the process. I mean, there's no learning without failing. You know, the great thing about being a scientist. So you can get to, you learn stuff every day, you know, just new things every day. There's never a dull moment in science, that's for sure. This is uh, Rancho Cucamonga, and I really, really like uh, the area where we live. Being able to go back home and being with the family, with the wife and kids, it really uh, uh, just made a difference. And just getting the strength to come back the next day, even though I failed miserably the day before. Personally, I don't see a, a, um, a conflict at all of being a, a man of faith and a man of science. We search for truth. Uh, we try all sorts of ways to approach truth, and we test all of our different approaches. The only way to know God is to experiment and, and really uh, have an experience with God Otherwise, it's just you know, something that's in a book, something that people talk about. But it isn't until you experience yourself uh, that you can really know the truth. And that really is the scientific process. You, know, you have a hypothesis of something and then you test it by doing experiments. And those experiments will tell you uh, uh, a conclusion. You know? And that is exactly uh, the same uh, way I feel about uh, my spirituality. I'm in a search for truth. And I want to know God, and I want to know and understand where I come from, who I am, where I'm going.